Hey, I just want to make this video right quick, man, to have uh, a little compassion for the people, man. Um, it brought tears to my eyes, man, to see what the people in Houston going through, um, because that could be me, that could be you, that could be anybody. Um, this is a special edition of No Boo Creation TV, and I just want to talk about um, Pastor Joel Osteen and uh, not opening up the doors of the church. Um, Joel Osteen is known as a televangelist who sells uh, millions of books every year. Um, has a huge church in the Houston area called Lakewood. And I don't understand, you know, why the people cannot go to the Lakewood church. We're talking about uh, a lot of people that have lost their lives, older people that can't get out of their homes. Um, and some say, what would Jesus do in this type of scenario? And I tell you that Jesus would have compassion for the people. When Jesus healed people, he had compassion for them. That's the reason why he moved. That's the reason why he opened up a man's eyes. That's the reason why he did the things that he did. And though as Christians, people, we may have not um, live like it. We may have not... Um, done all the right things but this right now is an opportunity for the body of Christ to step up in this situation um, for those that are in Houston those that can get to Houston um, just a call to the uh, to the believers man um, on helping those that are in Houston because a catastrophic event can happen in can happen anywhere anything can happen anywhere where people can lose their home, their cars, their money, food, water, whatever it may be. So I just wanted to make this video because I have compassion for those people and I'm hurting for those people that are going through what they're going through in Houston. Um, it's not about me, it's not about any of us, but it's about if, if you're able to help or donate or whatever you're able to do to help those people. Um, we're called to do that. And like I said before, you know, Jesus, the main thing about God is that these are the type of situations he thrives in and, um, he thrives through his people. He's always going to use people. That's one thing that you have to know about God. He's always going to use people to, uh, do his bidding for him. People that are moved by the spirit and by the Holy Ghost to do uh, what God has asked them to do. So my heart goes out to the people in Houston, Texas for go um, going through uh, Hurricane Harvey as it pretty much pummeled and destroyed a lot of stuff. Uh, a lot of people lost their homes and they got to start over. And they can rebuild and they can restore and they can start over. But some people have lost their lives as well. So my heart goes out to you who lost loved ones and family members in the Houston, Texas area. Um, definitely, um, God will see you through. And um, I'm hoping that Pastor Joel Osteen would have a change of heart and that he would open up that church to those people because that's truly what he should be doing. Those people um, give offerings every Sunday, every week probably. Um, to that church and Joel Osteen have made millions of dollars and To turn your back on the people it's like the people to turn their back on you when you need when you when you need them to come to give you offering or Give the church offering so that the church can take care of things and the church is not doing its job That's not good and you get a lot of people that make videos and bash Christianity because of this but I'm here to tell you that that's not the heart that God would have. That's not the heart that Christ would have. Christ would have compassion towards the people and he would heal them and he would restore them. And, and I'm hoping that that's what um, Joel Osteen will take the time to do is to reflect upon that those people need somewhere to go. If another man can open up a furniture store and let people come in 
um, get food, water, clothing, sleep on the couches, sleep on the chairs, whatever they got at, wherever they have to sleep at. That man had compassion and he may not be a Christian, but he had compassion towards the people and God sees that. Just like a man in the Bible named Cornelius that God saw giving alms unto the poor. God's heart is always to restore the people and Houston needs to be restored. So I just wanted to make this video just to let you know that my heart goes out to the people in Houston because that can happen anywhere. A catastrophic event can happen anywhere on this planet and on this earth. My heart goes out to you in Houston that you guys, that God would meet your every need and that he would provide for you. So we'll see. We'll see what goes on, but um, Houston has to be restored. And Joel Osteen, we charge you as the people to be able to help those people in your community, those people that pay tithes to you, those people that give offerings to you every week. Help those people out because you're obligated to do that. All right, you guys, this is Noble Creation TV signing out. I just wanted to give a special addition to say my heart goes out and I have compassion for the people in Houston because that could be me and that could be you. Peace.